what is the underlying cause of this crazy histamine release or problem tolerating histamines? What do you guys think is the root cause? <laughs> Let's go to root causes, okay? I'm gonna ask you guys, because um, there were comments here under hives was what what is the root cause, mm -hmm. right? People say I've been having hives for the last couple of weeks and I've been going to all these doctors and they keep trying to give me medications and we'll go into medications more later, but I wanna unveil for people right now, what do you guys think out there is the root cause? What is the underlying cause of this crazy histamine release? or problem tolerating histamines, because I have a feeling you're going to know more than your doctor <laughs> right now. And then I would love besides, you know, like someone saying like, oh, you know, there's some, something allergic, like pollen I'm allergic to, and that it's triggers allergy. That's an obvious answer, right? But what are some shocking reasons? What are the real causes of mass cell activation histamine intolerance? Dr. J and then Kathy. Ooh, and look at how smart yeah. this person is. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think Krista nailed it down uh, there. With I, Kristen it is, is in uh, our program right now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, it, it really comes back to digestion and food tolerance, right? Uh, because ultimately, I mean, a lot of the histamine that builds up in our system builds up in our gut when we're not breaking that food down. Um, it goes right back to the food mapping system of understanding what foods that you're responding to, um, how to how to lower the histamine levels in the food. I mean, it, it just comes back to digestion. I want to share just this diagram for me is just a review because I know a lot of you have seen my lives. And if you want to learn more about the food mapping system, I have other videos that go in more depth. But there's four components to these histamine reactions on the very left upper corner. That is digestion, my friends. OK, so for me, I am not listening or addressing you properly if I am not training your sweet ass on digestion because your doctor sure as hell isn't trained and ain't gonna help you with it. Hi, I'm Meg UMD and I'm a functional and holistic medicine physician and the creator of the Transform and Transform Protocol. If you're interested in learning what are the root causes of all chronic disease, go ahead and click the link in the description where I have a power pack 30 minute training that goes over what are the five pillars of Transform. Go ahead, click the link and I'll see you in that training. So for me, <laughs> excuse my French, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a fan of the cursey word. I'm sorry if I'm offensive, but like I, 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 we are an educational program because for goodness sakes, you have to learn how to be smarter than them because they know nothing. So uh, on that left upper corner, digestion is something that in our food mapping system, we train you, we train providers and we train you. Okay. And so that piece is what step is broken? How do I address it? Right. And even merely if you're like, can I take a digestive support that actually can help with some of this? Yes. Digest it. We have a product. I mean, if you're like, I can't do anything else. I give me one supplement that helps with digestion. Yeah. Right here. Digest it. It's our top selling product because it works. It, it does address every phase of digestion. There is supplementation that can be helpful. Right. But my thing about it is Digestion for me, there's a master's degree around that <laughs> and I love teaching it. So part of our food mapping system is to educate you about digestion because you 50% and I, I'm not overstating this and I'm going to ask Kathy and Jason to share their experience around this. To me, 50% when we deal with mast cell and histamine tolerance all day long, I have mm -hmm. programs and I can tell you right now by addressing digestion within a couple of weeks, at least 50% of the people will have 50% of the symptoms in resolution, if not more. And that's just one piece of digestion. And that's missing from all mast cell and histamine intolerance care. Dr. J, Kathy, what are, what are your thoughts around that? Yeah, we hear that all the time, right? I mean, that, I mean, I think we were just on a call a day or two ago and, and, and someone mentioned, I've only started this a couple of weeks ago and oh my gosh, my symptoms are so much better already. My digestion is so much better. Um, and that's always, you know, very exciting to hear. Uh, so, you know, and it's, and it's something that's overlooked and not taught well. Again, I keep coming back to the, to the front end of education. There's so much that needs to change there. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's filling in that missing gap. It's such an important piece and it's so overlooked. And we do see changes very quickly. Kathy, what yeah. about you? Um, I just want to add to that, that um, we're not even filling in a gap. We're, we're setting the foundation uh, because yeah. too many other natural healthcare practitioners, uh, Functional medicine practitioners included want to dive right in and, you know, either look at the, their hormones or their whatever they're do, They want to do all these other testing. Um, and they haven't started with the most important, which yeah. is digestion. And the way that 
um, the transform program is set up is so like Dr. Jason said, you can be on module one or two and start seeing amazing results without even getting to the other testing. And then the other testing only serves to inform what's already going on in the body and the resolutions that you're already seeing. So for me, it's a foundation. Oh, uh, I, I would just add too uh, that uh, what I love about the food mapping system, I just wanna come back to that real fast, uh, is that it is a complete system and it really, it really pulls in digestion, mm -hmm. um, theta, um, the lowering the histamines and then um, helping helping get the nutrient levels up. I've been doing this work for 20 years and I I don't know when I started saying it, but you know, a few years ago I started saying, I really believe that true health begins in the gut and begins with our diet. And it definitely is related to the mass cell activation syndrome and histamine intolerance and, and allergy issues. Hi, and thank you for watching this video. If you're interested in actively looking for a solution to your problem and you'd like to work with us, I'm going to invite you to go ahead and click the link in the description to book a chat with our team. I and my team look forward to talking to you to learn more about you to see if we are indeed a good fit to work together. Thank you.